someone's looking into a hubcap of a car and sees their reflection 49 centimeters uh, past the hubcap. Then they'll flip it over and she sees the image much closer over here at uh, just 10 centimeters past the hubcap. So we're trying to figure out how far away is this person looking and what's the radius of the curvature here. Well, let's realize that to solve this, we want to use the equation 1 over f equals 1 over the distance to the object plus 1 over the distance to the image. From there, we should kind of remember that when we're looking at a concave mirror, the focal point is positive. But when we're looking at the convex version, then the focal point here is actually negative. So when we set up this equation for this side, 1 over f, uh, this is technically supposed to be a negative f, so let's just keep track of that. 1 over d uh, naught plus 1 over d of the image. If we wanted to solve this, then we have to set these equal to each other, but let's make this positive and then multiply this by a negative so that will uh, take care of itself. At this point, we could set the equations equal to each other, so we'll go 1 over d object plus 1 over d of the image on that side is going to be equal to negative 1 over d of the object minus 1 over d of the image there. So now we can try to plug in the actual numbers for these d images right here, these di's. So let's go ahead and do that. 1 over d of the object, and then this is going to be minus 1 over 49 on that side is going to be equal to uh, 1 over d naught there. And then um, here we're going to subtract negative 10, so we're really just adding a uh, tenth there. And then we can rearrange this by putting the these over here, and then we'll get 2 over d of the object is equal to 1 over 10 plus 1 over 49. So let's try to go ahead and solve that. But we're going to have to want to divide this answer by 2, so that way we can get a 1 on top there. It'll make these a little easier. If we put this in the calculator, 1 over 10 plus 1 over 49, and we divide that by 2, uh, then we're going to do 1 over the answer to get the, the d naught d of the object. So that should give us 16.6 centimeters for this object. And that's how far away that she is when she's looking. Now in order to find the radius of the curvature, let's try to solve for this f, because f is equal to the radius of the curvature divided by 2. And so if we take our f and multiply that by 2, we'll get the radius of the curvature. So what is f, 1 over f? That's just going to equal uh, this expression here. Let's just solve it for this side. So 1 over the object uh, length was supposed to be 16.6. And then we're just going to subtract that number right there. So 1 over 49. And uh, then we're going to go ahead and uh, go 1 over answer on that side. So that way we get the f is equal to 21, 5.1 f equals 25.1. We're going to want to multiply that by 2, so we'll just get 50.2, and that's going to be the radius of the curvature, centimeters. Right on.